Good morning. I am Deshaun. The weather for today is cloudy. Right now it's 61 degrees, but it's going to be 72 for the high. You guys, it's, it's cloudy, so I think I'll be able to go outside because you know that I just said that I can't go in the heat. So, I finally figured out how to get Chunky to join the classroom because they, they've been doing online homework and, online, you know, doing the school and online, you know, since they can't go to the schools. But the thing is, i just been having her go on there and do the assignments. But uh, I finally figured out how to get her to join the class when the... Uh, when the her friends and stuff when they're on there so she can be on there and they can do the assignments at the same time online so i finally figured that out so i'm happy about that and uh her teacher said she's doing very well with the online work and i'm glad about that y'all because i that was one of the things that was stressing me out because i was like you know what if she's not doing well with the online even though she would do the assignments but i just i don't know i was it it, it, it was something that was stressing me because y'all know she ate on the road and i want her to stay on a on the road so that's why we you know we're always doing homework because i want her to get these assignments completed every day because they get a different assignment every day and they have other work that they could do for uh extra credit and everything so she she does the extra credit work and you know so i'm trying to keep her busy and i'm glad that she's able to see her other friends in the classroom so it should, you know so she can keep in touch with her friends and feel like you know they're actually in class together because i know they miss each other so I'm I'm glad I figured that out because y'all yeah, I tell y'all I was stressing about that. I was like, oh no, I can't get her to join the classroom. Like I can get her to do the work, but I couldn't get her in the classroom. I was like, I can't get her to join the classroom, but I figured it out. So happy about that. She's happy about that. So it took a load of stress off of me. So, you guys, um, I was talking to one of my nurses about the situation that happened with my homeboy. Or, I don't even know what to call him anymore because he's not a friend. He's, I don't even know what to call him. But I told her about the situation. And she was telling me that she think I need to tell my therapist, talk to my therapist about it. I was like, for what? She was like, because y'all were friends for years. And for you to just, you know, come across this, she was like, it's probably hurting you. I was like, no, I'm not hurt. She was like, are you sure? I was like, yeah, I'm cool. And she was like, uh, I still think you should talk to your therapist about it. I don't know, because... I don't want to talk to her about it because I don't, I don't care. You know, it is what it is. I'm glad I found out the truth after all these years. But it is what it is. Me talking to my therapist is not going to change anything. I'm just going to have to cut him off just. Just plain as that, just, and then the, the thing is, we share some of the same friends because, you know, whenever, whenever we would do stuff, you know, we invite other people to come along and, you know, as a group, we all have fun and, yeah, that's just what I'm going to have to do, you know, I just, I deleted his number. 
once I delete somebody's number, that's it. Because I don't remember numbers by heart. Yeah, I know how my memory is. So I'm not going to remember his number. So it has been deleted. So there's no way from him for him, me and him to talk. And if he called me, I'm not going to answer because I'm not going to recognize the number. So, you know, that's, that's what it is. And it's just, I don't know. Man, forget it. I don't even want to talk about it. Like, I like talking to y'all, you know what I mean? Because y'all y'all be giving me advice and everything. And I don't want to run to my therapist about everything, you know what I mean? Because y'all, y'all kind of like my therapist. When I talk to y'all, you know, that, that relieves some stress out from my chest. And y'all keep my mind flowing and everything. But I ain't worried about it, you know. It is what it is, you know. We we can't be friends no more because you lied. You've been lying all of these years, all of these years, from two thousand three to two thousand twenty. You've been lying, but I'm, it's cool, you know. I don't I don't care. It is what it is. Just I'm done with it. It. <sighs> okay, whatever. I don't even want to talk about it no more. Okay, you guys. So, you know we on lockdown. And they talking about... Um, see, I thought it was going to end this week. I thought April the 2nd was going to be the last day of lockdown. It's not. They had extended to April the 30th. Y'all, I don't like this. Uh y'all know I got a, a addiction, a Dollar Tree addiction. I just I just wanna go to Dollar Tree. They but they say you can't be in the streets. They said the only thing that you could be in the streets for is if you are going to the grocery store. It I mean to me Dollar Tree could be considered a grocery store because they do have a grocery section y'all know in the back of the store where the, all the frozen food and the groceries and everything so it could be considered a grocery store i don't know i just i hate being stuck in the house y'all i i hate that and i mean it sucks but they say you and then you can't even go to your doctor's appointment they said no doctor's appointment. So they have canceled everybody's doctor's appointment. And they even canceled my kids' dentist appointment. What was it the dentist? It was one of one of my was it the dentist or was it for one of their checkups? I don't know. But they doctor didn't even call the counsel and said we're gonna have to reschedule. They're gonna let us know when. Yo. Let me tell you something. This being in the house is going to make some people go crazy. Like myself. You you don't want us in the streets. We can't go nowhere except for the grocery store. And then when you do go to the grocery store, they limit you to, you can only buy two of things. Just two. And y'all know me. Like if I have a coupon, if the coupons say I gotta buy more than two, then you know what I mean. What, I, what I'm supposed to do? I'm a couponer. I need to get the correct amount so I can use my coupon. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. You know, I don't know. And then when we go to the stores, most of the time they be out of everything, so you know. People are ordering groceries, but the thing is, when you order your groceries, they'll send you the groceries, but the stuff they're out of, they're just out of it, you know? 